Hey everyone, this is Pilot and welcome back to another episode of the Mock Workshop. In today's episode, we'll be exploring one of the most valuable tools for mocking, that of course being BrickLink Studio. Studio is a digital LEGO building program similar to LEGO Digital Designer, which allows you to build LEGO on your computer. This is far from Studio's only use, however, as you can also create custom instruction booklets and renders of your models. In addition, it's also possible to take any model you've built and export it for use in 3D printing or 3D animation, which is something I also plan to do a video on. Clearly, Studio is a very useful tool, but for Bonacle Maka specifically, we'll have to take some extra steps to get the most out of this program. Something you'll notice pretty quickly about Studio is that despite its vast catalog of parts, there are many Bonacle pieces missing from it. You also see some colors missing as well, such as gunmetal or dark gold. As you can imagine, this heavily limits what Bonacle Makas can achieve with Studio, so the community has developed solutions in the form of part and color packs. These packs are unofficial and need to be installed separately from Studio itself, which often leads to confusion for many. In this video, I'll give you step-by-step -step instructions for how to install these packs, specifically for Windows, which should fully equip you to start building Bonacle Mocks in Studio. Now without further ado, let's begin. The first step in getting set up with Studio is of course to download the program itself. Studio can be found on the homepage of Brinklink's website, though I've also left a link to it in the description. There you can also find links for the other downloads I'll be referencing in this video, namely the part and color packs. Downloading Studio should be pretty straightforward, just follow the prompts and you should be good to go. There will also be a tutorial when you first boot up Studio, which isn't required but can be nice if you're new to the program. Now that we've installed Studio itself, let's move on to the part and color packs. Believe it or not, the process for installing a part pack is actually pretty simple. In this tutorial, we'll be installing one specific part pack called the Bio Pack, which contains many of the official Bonacle pieces Studio is missing. The Bio Pack is just one of the numerous Bonacle part packs you can add to Studio, and the installation process is the same across all of them. Unlike the Bio Pack, these part packs contain a slew of custom Bonacle parts, so they're definitely worth checking out. The Bio Pack can be found in a topic on the TTV message boards, though I've also gone ahead and linked it below. On the topic, there will be a link to download the pack, which will then take you to a Google Drive folder. Click this folder on the right and press the download button in the upper right corner. You may get a message saying the pack can't be scanned for viruses, which you can just ignore by clicking download anyways. Now you should have the Bio Pack downloaded, and with that, here are the steps for installing it. Step 1. Press the Windows key plus R on your keyboard, which should open a small text box at the bottom of your screen. Click on the box and type in percent local app data percent, then press enter. Step 2. Now you should see a window in File Explorer with a bunch of folders. Find the folder called Studio and open it. Step 3. Within the Studio folder, look for another folder called Custom Parts. If it's not there, then make a folder and call it Custom Parts. Make sure the folder name has this exact formatting, otherwise Studio won't be able to recognize it. Step 4. Open another window in File Explorer, don't close the other one, and find your download of the Bio Pack. This can usually be found in your Downloads folder, and once you find it, open it. Step 5. When you open the Bio Pack folder, you'll notice three other folders called Collider, Connectivity, and Parts. You'll want to drag and drop these folders into the Custom Parts folder you created in Step 3. Step 6. Close Studio if you had it open, and reopen the program. Click on this drop-down menu above the parts library, and you should see a new option called Custom Parts. Select it, and now you'll see all your new parts from the Bio Pack. Step 7. Finally, repeat this process for any of the other part packs you want to install. Now let's move on to installing the Color Pack. Unlike the part packs, there's only one color pack you really need, and that's the Bonacle Day Community Color Pack. This pack contains the missing colors I mentioned before, such as gunmetal or dark gold, but it offers a ton of other options as well, like marbled or glowing colors. The link to download the Bonacle Day Color Pack can be found in another post on the TTV message boards, which also contains the extra part packs I brought up previously. The process for downloading this color pack is the same as the bio pack from before, so let's move on to the steps for installing it. Step 1. Open File Explorer and locate your download of the color pack. Like with the bio pack, it will most likely be in your downloads folder. Once you find the folder, open it. Step 2. Open a second window in File Explorer and navigate to the color pack as you did in step 1. Now you should have the color pack open in two separate File Explorer windows. Step 3. In one of the windows, it doesn't matter which one, locate a file called Easy Install Shortcut Win and double click it. This is a shortcut that will take you directly to the color files for Studio. Step 4. In the window with the color pack still open, locate two files called Custom Color Definition and Custom Color Settings. Drag and drop these files into the other window, and when you do, you should get an option to replace files in the destination. Click Replace and the old color files will then be replaced with these new ones. Step 5. Close Studio if you had it open and reopen the program. Now when you navigate to the color selector, you should see your new custom colors. 
And with that, you should now be ready to start building Bonacle mocks in Studio. Studio is an extremely valuable tool, and I hope this tutorial was helpful for anyone trying to get started with it. I know when I first started, the process of installing all the part and color packs seemed quite daunting, so I figured a proper tutorial would be of help. If you have any questions or comments about this tutorial, please feel free to let me know in the comment section down below. Thanks for watching, and this is Pilot, signing off.